What is happening, everybody? Welcome back to Dark Horse Sports Cards. You have Brody here back with another fun, exciting video. Today, we are opening up some new product. Yes, 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 yes. We have the 2024 rookie class finally here. But there is a massive but. This is Score Hobby 2024. The checklist is not out yet. And no sign of Caleb Williams. So, what does that mean? I don't know. Everyone's kind of freaking out a little bit. He has no cards in this product. Every other player has cards. Uh, obviously, some of the players don't sign in 2024 because they are signed with Fanatics. Uh, but you can still pick some big uh, rookies autographs out of this product. We pulled a JJ McCarthy last night, $200 plus dollar card. We also pulled a gold Brock Purdy auto out of this. So you can pull some pretty big vets as well as rookies out of this. But what are we looking? This is a product right now that's on Panini's site that's like $215, probably closer to $240 once taxes, shipping, all that stuff gets accounted for. And you're going to get a lot of cards out of one of these boxes. 400 cards to be exact. That's 40 cards per pack, 10 packs per box. The first 20, 25 cards are all base. So you can kind of just fly through those. We'll look at the, you know, we'll get a feel of what they look like first, but we will fly eventually through those. We've got a couple case hits to go after. The Intergalactic, I don't know what that looks like. The Showtime, they actually do have this as uh, one of the images. Those actually look kind of cool. And then the next up insert as well. Uh, you can also find some of the um, old school designs in here if you're looking interested in that. And four autographs. That's the big thing. Four autographs. We did pull a very interesting card last night in our breaks. If you haven't joined our breaks over on Whatnot, don't miss out. Use the link down below. $15 off. But we have a very interesting pull. We had a mystery redemption. It said mystery rookie five. So I don't know if that's because they don't know if Caleb Williams is going to sign or some of these guys are going to sign. Marvin Harrison Jr., I don't really know what that means, uh, but that is exciting. I did tell the person that pulled it uh, to let us know what they ended up getting. Uh, but here, massive set, 300 base, 100 rookies. And you can kind of see, you can pull stuff all the way down to a one of one, which would be sweet. They got printing plates in here as well. And like I said, they do have a lot of autographs as well as some other uh, inserts in here. But let's give it a little go. Let's see. It's a fun box too. <laughs> it's like perfectly square. It's a fun box to just kind of spin around. I do like the presentation. I have no idea. Anyone have any clue why they have Justin Herbert on this box? No idea why he's on it. But he actually didn't have a bad first game. Just kind of a weird person, I think, to have on it. But the presentation, I mean, that's kind of nice, right? We'll take that. Also, big thumbs up on this video if you guys like the new sound. Uh, we need to put some stuff on the walls in here. I took a lot of stuff out that was kind of helping dampen the sound. Now the sound kind of echoes around this room a little bit. So we need to do a little bit of a sound control in this room. But we are going with a microphone today. So if it sounds better and you like it, we will keep rocking with the microphone. Uh, and hopefully that is better viewing experience for you guys at home. So if you guys are liking the content, definitely like uh, drop a like down below. We appreciate all the likes and all the new subscribers as well. Now let's pull some bangers here. So we're going to start off with the Bijan. That is a second year Bijan. And you can just see the amount of base in this set is actually a little bit overwhelming. Um, if it's great if you're trying to get a complete set. You probably only need to buy one or two of these boxes. There's a second year Puka. Uh, but you can just see the amount of base that comes out of this set is crazy. Now there is a very subtle parallel. I'll let you know. Did we just get a Cooper Cup auto or is that a number to 100? Nope, that's a gold. That's a color match. 12 out of 50 gold Cooper Cup. We'll take that to start us off. Very pretty card. Um, there is a parallel that's very hard to tell. I'll show you. Our first look there at Xavier Worthy actually had a great debut with the Chiefs. Looks like he's going to fit in very well. We got the edge rusher, Latu, for the Colts. There's a little insert 
of Anthony Richardson. We have another insert, and this is going to be a Barry Sanders. And then you get the slew of rookies at the end. So we got Jonathan Brooks. There's a nice Michael Penix. McMillan. Keon, Keon Coleman's nice. Bailey. Walker. We've got um, Gabriel Murphy here. Troy Fatunu. I got to work on my names. And hey, kid reporters are now live. So if you're interested, go take one. It is yours, my friends. It is yours. Um, so that is kind of what this product does look like. I don't know if this is a great product to dome, but I gotta tell you, it's not gonna be a bad one to have in the breaks. We had multiple cards pulled that were worth over $200, and we had a handful of cards that were worth $30, $40, $50. So um, when it comes to breaks, adding these in, I think we're gonna do some of that, adding in some 2024 with 2023. And uh, make it, ooh, what is that? What is this? Oh, wow, case hit. Wow, oh my gosh, it's a, oh, what? Janice! Janice! What the heck? That is disgusting. And it's on like a chrome, a thicker, and eh, it's not chrome, it's still paper. What is it? Case hit. Look at it. It's like a hollow. It's like, um, oh, what do they call these? Terrible. What do they call oh, these? Oh, like one of those. Yeah, what is that? Um, you see the difference? Yeah. What the heck? Um, oh my gosh. What is, what that, is that, called? that called? People are probably screaming at Yeah, us right they now. probably are. Can you update the board for me? Yes. Thank you. Okay. Well, I literally. Oh, I'll head. update the board. I'll update the board. I'm in my pajamas. I'll update the board. That's sick. What the heck? Holographic. No. Holographic is like uh, Pokemon, where it's it's got like some shine to it. That's Cor like Corbin. I know those from Pogs. I used to have some of those in Pogs, where I had one where it was a girl and she had a scab and she was ripping her scab Ew. like this That's in disgusting. Pogs. What is that called? Holographic. No, holographic is like Pokemon. Corbin, what is this? What is the car? What is this card called? Where you can. It's like um. What is that? Yeah, it's holographic. Is it? Yeah, it's holographic. But that's not what a holographic is in Pokemon. This isn't Pokemon. All right, it's not Pokemon. Well, anyways, that's cool. And I just got Brock Purdy auto. No, I didn't. Dang it. <laughs> out of 100. All right, Brock Purdy out of 100. Not too bad. Hey, I'm telling you, score? Kind of a fun rip. <laughs> kind of a fun rip, you know? All right, let's keep it going. Let's keep it going. We got Michael Penix on the emerged... Derek Carr, J.J. McCarthy there, a Brian Thomas Jr. We have a Kitchens, Malik Neighbors first look, uh, Robinson, Pratt, Guyton, Baker, what's this, Latham, and a Johnson. But like I was saying before we got kind of spooked by that card, this is a fun product just to rip uh, in, in some of the breaks. I don't know if I would ever dome a box of this for like 250 bucks like we're doing today. Um, but it is fun if you are trying to collect. Okay, see this parallel right here coming up? This is what I'm telling you. So this is a parallel, but it's like pretty much so hard to even tell the difference. See how this one's kind of got like the border and this one doesn't? I don't think it's I don't think anyone's going to give a rip about it, but just wanted to let you know that is one of the parallels. I think that's probably called um, Gold Zone? No. I don't know what that's actually called. If you know what that's called, let me know. Because it says Base Showcase. Maybe that's Showcase. Yeah, I guess that's Showcase. That probably makes sense. Showcase. All right, we got a Michael Parsons. There's a Bijan on the Emerge. A Joe Alt. Very solid performance from him. In his first game, Eric Dickerson, I'm sure uh, Justin Herbert's going to pay or buy him a very, very nice uh, Christmas gift coming up. We got a Wilson. There's a Xavier Leggett. He's got to do something for Bryce Young. Spencer Rattler, Drake May, Jenkins, and another kid reporter. We Oh, we also have to talk, guys. Oh, what? Is Tua done? Is Tua... 
Is Tua just completely done? I, I think Tua might be... He might never take a snap again. For those that have never had a concussion before, and maybe don't really know the severity of it, I've had a concussion, so I've done my research. Um, it's one of those things, see, that's another one of those. Uh, oh, it, it says right there, scorecard. Oh, okay. I don't think anyone cares. But it's one of those things where if you get a concussion and then you get another one really quickly after that, really bad. If you get a concussion and then a couple of years later you get a concussion, not as bad. But when you get them back to back, really, really bad. And then there comes a time too where it doesn't even matter the length in between the concussions. At a certain number, it starts just going really downhill. I think he's at that number. I really do. And I hope he's got family around him that tell him, listen, I know you want to play football. I know you're a football player. There's a second year CJ Stroud. I know you're a football player, but your life's more important. And we don't want you not being able to talk or be able to like have a normal life uh, years from now, right? So I don't know. I, I think a lot of people just, they don't view concussions as that big of a deal. And I wish they did, man, because they're scary. They're serious. They can give you some serious, serious, long-lasting damages. So I, I, I hope he doesn't have any... Uh, I hope he gets the people that tell him the right stuff. Um, and that's all I'll say about that. All right. Moving on. Still looking for some more autos. We don't have a single auto yet. We have a Mason Smith here. There's a Josh Allen. Marvin Harrison Jr. I'm going to be chasing the crap out of this guy. I'm very happy that he's in here. I know I don't know if he's going to sign or not. That's still kind of a weird thing. All right, and we have a J.C. Latham as our first auto. J.C. Latham, a little offensive lineman love for the Tennessee Titans. All right. Um, but I know I'm going to be chasing him. Definitely. All right, L Laciest. I don't know how to say that. I'm sorry. Josh Newton, I'm going to butcher some of these names until I hear them sa said. Or you guys correct me until oblivion, you know. It is what it is. All right. Also, if you are interested in the rookies, guys, I'm probably, like the rookies inserts and stuff, I'm probably going to throw all these up as a lot. Um, so definitely check out our eBay. We have a bunch of big, big cards ending this weekend over on our eBay. Link in the description down below. And then also on whatnot, I'm going to be throwing a bunch of these cards up. Like this card will probably be on eBay. Uh, the Purdy, this will maybe I'll throw this on whatnot. I kind of show love to both of them. So definitely, uh, definitely, definitely, definitely check out whatnot store and eBay uh, for cards if you're interested. But yeah, a lot of these rookies, what does that say? Oh, signed on the Texans. Okay. A lot of these rookie lots, I'm just going to throw up and uh, Jake Ferguson on the scorecard. And if you're interested, go go scoop them up. Get them for your collections. Uh, Arenas Williams. We have a Malik Neighbors on the Emerge. Najee Harris. Oh. Yes. That's that's a big one. Roma Dunze. Roma Dunze. Yes, sir. Love it. Very nice. He's actually probably one of the top guys that signed. In this class right now, you know, outside of the quarterbacks, he's he's solid. We'll take that a little Roman Dunze. All right, see what he does with Caleb Williams. Their offense looked absolutely atrocious week one, but you know they're gonna have a crazy good defense around them, so it might not matter. That is, there's a first look at Xavier Worthy rookie and his Texas uni. Texas, talk about a team that's also disgusting. I mean, I think Michigan's bad. But, uh, you know, Texas does look like the real deal this year. Could be a fun Texas-Georgia playoff. All right, throw through, roll through the base here quickly. And a Shaq Thomas. That's going to be number to 10. Shaq Thomas, gold, number to 10. Wow. Panthers. Hit some low numbers out of here. 
I honestly think our case is pretty juicy. We've hit a lot of no num low numbered cards. Um, so we'll take, is that number two? Ah, oh, he's number six, seven. That's number seven. All right, we got Ray Lewis, Justin Herbert, the guy on the box. Uh, this name, I'm going to need help with. Adrik Estim. Adrik Estim. Cooper DeJean. Uh, first look at Bo Nix there. We have a Blake Corum. Newbin. There's a Marvin Harrison Jr. A Hall. Powers Johnson. Kamal Madden. Is that Madden? No, Hayden. Kamal Hayden. Ennis Rakestraw. And a Junior Colson with another kid reporter. Get all your kid reporters. Bring out your dead. Bring out your dead. All right, we're moving forward. We got Jim Kelly. Fly through the base. No. Okay, it's not an auto. Whew. Almost freaked out. The autographs, they tell you that it's an auto right here. They'll say that this autograph from Panini right there. So I thought it was an auto. That would have been nuts. 45 out of 100, Lamb Jack on the blue. That would have been nuts. Another CJ Stroud, second year here on the franchise. He is the franchise. I agree with that completely. He seems like he's going to be a starter for the Texans for a very, very long time. Another Williams here. There's a Penix on the hot rookies. Micah Parsons. There's our first look at Jaden Daniels for the Commanders. We have a Wilson, uh, a Bell, a Cooper, Jackson, Polk, Fasuni, Elias, and there's a Lad McConkey. That guy, that guy actually has some potential. He looked, he looked pretty solid in his first, uh, first game for the Chargers. I mean, Herbert needs someone to throw to because it ain't, it ain't QJ. That's for dang sure. It ain't QJ. All right, we got Bijan on the emerged. Joe Alt. That is a Eric Dickerson. Vinny Testaverde. I mean, see what I'm saying? You can pull some nice vet autos in here. Vinny Testaverde. Okay. There's a Jet fan out there that would love to have this card. And it could be yours. Because this is probably going to go up on eBay. So definitely check that out. All right. Jalen Harrell. Troy Franklin. Johnson. Aroma Dunze. Cedric Gray. Fisk. There's our first look at Brock Bowers. Is another guy that I'm going to be chasing this year for the Raiders. We have a Carson and a Darius Robinson. All right. We have made it to our final pack. I can't remember if we pulled three autos. I think we've, have we pulled three autos. We got the Testaverde, the Dunze, and the, yeah. Okay, so we should have an auto in here. We should have an auto. Maybe we get another redemption. I think this auto is going to be bad. If I had a guess, I'm going to go a bad rookie. Yeah, Tennessee Titan. It's a Tennessee Titan rookie, probably offensive lineman. That would be my guess. Jamal Williams, start us off. There's a Brock Purdy. We have a Dan Marino. A Michael Penix. And our auto is... Oh, never mind. The Freak. Javon Curse. The Freak with the 90 inscription there. The Freak. You see what I'm saying? People hate on score. But, like I said, if this was in a break... There's a couple teams that would be very happy. Very happy. And at this price score, all right, we did get a J.J. McCarthy too. That's nice. A Wiggins and finishing out with Elijah Jones. Uh, you know, at this price point, you can't be too upset. You really can't, folks. I mean, we hit the case hit. Tyreek Hill, very cool card on the showtime. Our, uh, we got a Stroud too. Our number cards, let me get these number cards here. Hold on. We got four number cards. Le Lamar Jackson out of 100. Shaq Thomas out of 10. We got a Brock Purdy out of 100. And a Cooper Cup out of 50. So that was nice. 
And then we did get our four autos. One being JC Latham. That's pretty much the worst auto. Then we got a very good auto in Roma Dunze. A solid auto with Vinny Testaverde. And a solid auto with Javon Curse with two vets. So two rookie autos, two vet autos. I got to tell you, score, this is a fun product. Now, am I going to want to rip score once we have Prism, Select, Obsidian, uh, Spectra? Once we have all that out, probably not. But the time to rip it right now is now. You know, these are the only times you can get these guys' autos in Panini products. Now, granted, they're not in their NFL jerseys. I get it. When they get into their NFL jerseys, that product will definitely be the hottest. But you still can get ink from some of your favorite rookies. You know, you got the Bears helmet down there. Chicago Bears on the back. It's not bad. It's not bad. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Make sure you like down below. Appreciate it so much. Me and Kelsey have some weddings to attend to this weekend. So we might be a little bit quiet on the social medias, on the whatnot shows, and here on YouTube. But we will be back. You can guarantee that. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you guys in the next one. Keep ripping them packs.